Sup my only pops, Ollie here. My mannequins have all gone missing, so let's go crazy. Wait, wait, whoa, hold on, hold on, sorry, sorry, wrong intro. What is going on you guys, my name is CPK and today I'm bringing you another awesome episode of Minecraft Crazy Craft, a huge YouTuber survival series with all of my friends. And today I, oh, hold on, sorry, sorry, hello? Uh, oh, okay. Okay. Uh, right. Okay. Little, I just got a little phone call there. Um, apparently there's something outside in a chest, uh, waiting for me. That's exciting. I don't really get phone calls like this. Um, but, uh, yeah, just quickly before I go outside and do everything, I did try and, uh, record an episode the other day for Easter. Scott had actually set up a fantastic Easter egg hunt, but my video actually completely corrupted and I couldn't record it. I did tweet about it. Um, I was very sad, Scott, I did a little easter egg hunt where I got a new orange backpack, I got a sponge pet, and, um, a strawberry chocolate bar, which I believe I still have here, yes, I do, um, and it was, it was really, really good, and I'm really sorry that I couldn't do it, but just so you know, there is a big egg out here, and there's some stuff that I haven't got rid of yet, but I wanted to explain it to you guys, but let's go see what, well, okay, there's a randomly placed chest, that'll, that'll probably have something to do with it, um, okay, let's have a look. Uh, I oh, have taken oh God! Your oh, okay. Mannequins. You will never see them again. Fine. That's too mean. But first, you must work out these three riddles. Then you can see them again. Riddle one: Find the home of a tasty breakfast snack. To find riddle two, and bring your friends back. Uh, oh, that was incredibly weird. I don't. I really don't know where that voice came from either. Um. Doesn't look like there's anyone around, so that's uh, strange. Uh, so we have to find the home of a tasty breakfast snack. There's only one thing to do. We need to use science to work out the correct answer. To the secret lab! Okay, so I'm sitting here trying to work things out. Uh, tasty breakfast snack. Could I eat Ashley? No, eating... You can't eat Joey? Don't think Joey's a breakfast snack. Uh, Lauren, Lauren's, Lauren's east side isn't, I don't think that's a snack. What about DJ, I uh, don't eat DJ, waffle, what, <gasps> what, waffles, waffles, waffles is a breakfast snack, right? Depending on what country you're in, because the waffles are a breakfast snack in some places. Let's go check waffles house, that must be where it is. I, I mean, I thought these, you know, didn't actually take me that long to work this out. Hello, sheep pit. Um. I didn't actually expect me to uh, get it as quick as I did. I thought I'd really struggle. I'm not usually very good at things like riddles. Um, I'm kind of curious as to who would take my mannequins, though. I mean, it's a very weird thing to do. I do like the mannequins, and they were my team for the war. Um, but, I mean, not the craziest thing that someone could have done. So I'm not entirely sure why they did that. I believe Waffles House is over in this direction. Um, behind all this stuff. There's a lot of very long grass around here. So, so let me get to Waffles House and then we'll, uh, we'll see if we can find, uh, riddle number two hidden somewhere. Okay, we've arrived. Now, where would... Ah, okay. Perfect. Another random place chest. Uh, this... Oh, this must be it. Ah, here we go. Riddle two. So, oh, God. Okay, the voice is back. Perfect. Uh, you worked that one out, didn't you? On to riddle two. Riddle two. Don't stop now. It's adventure time. Only one clue left to solve the crime. Hmm, okay, so don't stop now. It's adventure time. I mean, let's first... Is this something to do with adventure backpacks? Because that's what these are, right? So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a couple of these. Um, I'm pretty sure DJ Waffles won't mind. They do grow back very quickly. And this sets up for us doing a nice little episode on um, some backpacks. Because that could be fun, right? So, uh, don't stop now, it's adventure time. Only one clue left to solve the crime. Um, what could that mean? It's adventure time. I can't get out of Waffle's house. It's so unbelievably confusing. Um, I mean, adventure time. What could that mean? Adventure time. Is that even the key part of this? What on this server has anything to do with adventure time? Do you guys know? Because I really can't think. Um... I, unless I have to go on an adventure somewhere. What are these? They're adorable. Maybe there's somewhere I can go on an adventure. Also, the sponge pet lets me walk on water. Look how cool that is. Um, is it something to do with time? Is there a clock anywhere? 
Uh, adventure time, adventure time. What could it be? What could it be? What could it be? <gasps> Isn't Joel's tree from Adventure Time? Or is that Lizzie's castle? I can't. I think Joel's tree might be from Adventure Time. Okay, we'll go and have a look in uh, in Joel's. Uh, in fact, no, let's look at Lizzie's castle first, because that is closest. Let's have a quick look around. All the chests have been very randomly placed, so I'd have thought that they'd have been nice and easy to find. So if I can't find them very quickly, then okay, it doesn't look like they're here. Maybe it's Joel's tree that's from Adventure Time. Is it Joel's tree? I think it might be. Okay, let's go, let's go see if we can find any clues inside of Joel's Adventure Time tree. And uh, hopefully this will lead us on to clue number three, which will... Uh, ah, randomly placed chest with no sign. That sounds like this is kind of, this looks like the kind of place we'd find a clue. Let's have a look. Ah, riddle three. I'm hoping that that uh, strange voice that keeps coming from absolutely nowhere shows up to read this again. Ah, perfect. I can't believe you made it this far, but there is no way you will solve riddle three. The most difficult of all the riddles. Riddle 3. The friends that you are looking for are right under your nose. Or maybe above it. Hmm. Who knows? Okay, that's a strange one. The friends that I'm looking for are right under my nose? Um, I mean, that they're, they're not under my nose. I can see right now. All that's under my nose is my mouth. Um... So what, what under my nose? I mean, maybe it's something to do with my house. Um, I'll go and check back where they should have been. Um, so they're definitely not where they should be there. No, nope, definitely not there. They didn't take those ones. So because under my nose could have meant there. Um, okay, I need to start thinking outside of the box. It said it was the hardest riddle yet. So under my nose. Oh, maybe it's the the floating heads. Okay, let's go have a look at the heads. Um, under my nose. No, they're not there. Unless does Joel's thing go underneath my nose? Maybe someone's hidden them. No. Ah, I can't work this one out. Under my nose. What could it mean? Totoro has a nose. Maybe. <gasps> Ollie's panda. Ollie's panda has a nose. Ollie's panda has a big sticky out nose. If Ollie has stolen my mannequins, if this was all Ollie, I'm going to be incredibly upset. I, I mean, we 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 just made friends again. I, w I don't think he'd do something like this. He knows this would make me very upset because he doesn't like he doesn't steal from me. I hope. Okay, under the nose or above it. <gasps> there they are. He took the mannequin. Oh my right. That's it. I'm flying up there. He better have a really good reason for this. Okay, let's become something that can fly. I am so angry right now. Okay, here we go. Becoming a moth. Becoming a moth. Fully ascended. Oh, okay. Let's fly up and see what's going on. Ah, there's a chest. Perfect. Here's all the mannequin. Well, actually, my mannequin's not there. Where's my mannequin? Hmm. We'll work that one out in a minute, I guess. Framed. Okay. Um... Uh... I can't believe you worked it out. Good work, I, I guess. Now you must work out for yourself. Did Ollie commit the crime? Or do you think it's framing time? Oh, someone could be framing Ollie to try and make us fall out again. I don't know who would do that, though. But then I don't know why Ollie would steal my mannequins. I don't think Ollie would do that. Let's, oh, God. Let's go inside here and have a little look. See if there's any ideas as to whether or not he actually did it. Um, I just can't imagine him ruining our friendship like this again. When we we just became such good friends. Um, doesn't look like there's anything on any of the floors. I mean... Hold on. What? Why on earth is my mannequin right next to where he spends most of his day on the PC? Maybe he... He does, he does like to look at me, I think. Um, oh, I'm so confused. Um, I'm going to let you guys decide. What do you think? Do you think Ollie did it? Or do you think Ollie was framed by someone? And if he was framed, who do you think framed him? Let me know in the comments section, guys, because I am super, super confused. And I can't work out what the correct answer is. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode of Crazy Craft. I'm super confused right now. Um, thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to let me know in the comments what you guys think has happened. And uh, I guess I'll see you next time when we try and really work this out. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!